Jim Holly, Race Day Live, presented by Amsoil. Well, mm -hmm. Justin Barso, welcome back, round 14. Last time we saw you, Anaheim, uh, the third time we were at Anaheim yeah. there. Uh, you healthy? You ready to go? Yeah, it's been a while for sure. Uh, was, Anaheim was a long time ago, so yeah, I'm uh, you know getting healthier as the weeks go, and I've uh, been on the bike for about a week now, so it feels good. But uh, just here for the team and the fans, and just want to get out there and race. You know, I could have waited out and uh, you know for outdoors, but I just want to come back and race, and you know that's what I get paid for is to race. So. Uh, you know, it's not doing any good being at home sitting on the couch. So definitely happy to be here. It's uh, it's nice to be back at a race. It uh, you know gets the you know the nerves going a little, and it's fun. You know, you probably couldn't pick a better race to come back yeah. as far as traction. I mean, here in Houston, always the dirt's been great. Yeah, I'm interested tonight to see how the dirt's going to hold up. It looks like there's a little traction, but it's a little harder than usual, I think. So uh, we'll see how that goes. But yeah, I'm excited. It's just uh, it doesn't matter where we're at or what track we're at. I'm just excited to be here and uh, racing. You over and under bridge, you're going to hit that twice. Uh, you know, kind of a little bit of a different uh, format they're running here. Uh, something different for you. Your thoughts on that? Yeah, the start, whole, the whole start thing seems a little uh, odd, uh, going backwards on the track and stuff. I don't know. I'll see. We'll see how it works out. But uh, I don't know. There might be some changes going on today. <laughs> You got to remember also that first lap after you come over the over and under bridge, you got to hook to yeah. the right there on that first lap, and then the, you come back to that section, then you got to hook left. Yeah, I'm sure that all the riders are confused, and the fans are going to even be more confused when we're going all over the track. So, yeah, I don't know what the thinking was there, but uh, we'll see. Hopefully, it makes for some good racing, and, uh, you know, we'll see. As a rider, I mean, I know when I rode, you know, and you had things like that, I kind of always in the back of the, my, my mind when you're coming up to that section, I'm kind of watching the guy, hey, is he going to turn right or is he going to turn left? Well, yeah, that's the thing. You know, we have the track maps and stuff in the truck, and we're definitely going to study and look at them because it's something uh, you kind of forget in your brain. You're thinking about, you know, doing your laps and going the right way on the track, and then you throw something like that in the beginning. It's a little odd. So, yeah, definitely you want to focus on making the right choices out here and not making a mistake and going the wrong way on the track. You talked to uh, Phil Nicoletti, he's yeah. out, <laughs> you're back, he's out. Yeah, I think Phil's happy, I'm back, he can start getting ready for outdoors, that's you know kind of his main goal, he rides the whole outdoor series, so uh, yeah, I think he's happy I'm back, and uh, you know, Phil's a good guy, he did a good job filling in for me, and I appreciate that for sure. 